taken an opportunity while I have a chance to do a little bit of filming. According to the Weather Channel, the wind's supposed to die down in a second. And it's hopefully part two of the covered bridge tour. I have found a bunch of the covered bridges, kind of on the western side of things, northwestern side of things. I'm going to start out first with a couple that are just off of Marietta Avenue. Right, that is night and day better. More night than day for me because it's kind of darkest things in here. Oh, it's a beautiful little valley. See, Lancaster County is just, uh, especially here in spring, it's just so much beauty. Oh, lots of fallen debris. Coming up on Seagrist Mill Bridge. This again is just off of Prospect Road near Columbia and Marietta. And here it is. Wow, it just kind of pops out in the middle of things there. There's a plaque right there that tells about the history. Anyway, across we go, make a noise. <laughs> That's the joy of going to recover bridge. Okay, on to the next one. Turning on to Iron Bridge Road again. This next bridge is just off of Prospect Road as well. This is Forey's Mill Bridge we're coming up on. Wow. Oh, check that. Wow. The barn with the ancient painting of a chicken. Now, Rooster. Oh, well. Somebody took some time with that. I don't know. Ten foot six spirits. I think I'm going to make it. Look at that And make some noise. Okay, it's time to go to the next one. So we're going to be going over a couple of the bridges that I've already had over previously. Just because they're on the way. As a reminder, this is Shanks Mill. And time to make some noise. <laughs> I keep hearing the chirping of the voice of the GPS. I'm trying to figure out what it is. Oh my god, it's that. It's that, it's that. Oh, here's the other bridge here. Forgot the name of some of the artillery. Ready to make some noise. Aha. Okay, now this bridge up here, I don't think I'm able to go across. But I think it's only foot traffic. Yeah, it's foot traffic only. It's got a chain across it. This used to be a usable bridge. And they, uh, they moved it here because it was... So, there you go. There's the other covered bridge. You can only visit it if you're coming to go um, sightseeing. You can't actually go across it. On to the next one. So this is Keller's Mill Bridge. We're on Herb's Bridge Road. From what I understand, this bridge was not originally here. It was translocated from another place. I said translocated. Noise! Okay, we're gonna go back through Keller Mill Bridge. And head to the next one. Alright, this road bridge is uh no, it's not listed on my thing. I had a listing for it. Okay, make noise. Here's the plaque. It is Vicks Mill. Okay. okay. I love this little road through the woods. Houses on the other side. Very old houses. That one in particular. Okay, this next bridge has a little history behind it. 
was destroyed in 1977, washed away downstream by a flood from a hurricane. And then again, in 2011, it was the same thing happened. They raised it again, and they reentered. Thank you, the noise. This is the final bridge for today, Huntsaker Mills Bridge. It's on Huntsaker Road, I figure. And again, it has an interesting feature compared to all the other cover bridges that have been across where the slats do not go end to end, they go side to side. That's the last of them, folks. Thanks for watching. This has been Lancaster County, Pennsylvania, Cover Bridges, Part 2, with the Scoot and Fool. Hope you enjoyed it. Nice little ride. If you like what you've seen here, please like, share, and subscribe.